Testing, one, two, I think, I think we're coming through okay. Ken, can you hear me? Or if anybody else happens to be around. Testing, one, two. All right, hopefully that fixes it, I think. I think that will do it. Testing things. Where is, where in the world? There it is. Okay. Much better. Much better. Much smoother. Yeah, sorry about that. I, um, just finished hooking everything back up as far as like computer goes and things like that and uh i had to get all my settings back on happy tuesday to everybody i think it's a tuesday if i'm wrong you know let me know And what have I missed? What have I missed? Sorry for not being here yesterday. I was still moving so much furniture. But it's worth it. It's worth it. Because, I think by tomorrow, uh, maybe tomorrow, I still got a few things and, you know, kinks to work out and whatnot. I should have actually everything set up for doing things on camera. And uh, it won't be tomorrow, because I have to move things around still, just for the space for it. But, um, I happen to have a Lego Optimus Prime to, to, uh, to put together. Okay, well, OBS isn't that bad. It's just you got to pay attention to its settings sometimes because it likes to it likes to change things on you every now and then, especially with audio. Oh, it is tax day, isn't it? Oh, that's odd. I'm only getting. Hold on. I'm only getting chat from Ken. There we go. Now I think it's fixing. There we go. All right. Sorry, I had to refresh the page. Coyote, it's good to see you, man. Hey, Raymond. I feel like we're on another infinite load. So what have I missed in Star Citizen? Anything, anything decent? B-Win is fine. Entities are fine. Also, do I sound okay to you guys? I had to move my microphone around, so... Hey, Crow. I don't, I don't feel like I'm going to load in. Like, we've been waiting this long. Hold on, hold on. Can I hit escape? If I can hit escape, then... Nope, okay. I am loading in. It's just taking... <sighs> Forever. Forever. So, how was everyone's weekend? You know when the music stops, you've, you've had a bad time.
Ah, oh, come on, Star Citizen. Come on. Come on. Hey, Winston, I'm trying to get it to go all good, but, uh... Star Citizen appears to be having a conniption. I might actually just have to... You know what? We're just going to reload it. We're going to reload it. Trying to go back to the American server, see how that goes. Hey, Brian. Good to see you, man. I'm sorry to hear about the penguins. Yeah, GT, I am... Oh, man, GT, I am... I am beat up right now, man. I am so beat up. So, like, okay. Um, It'll probably still take me a day or two just to get everything, you know, where I want it. But, um... I I spent the entire weekend uh collecting furniture and moving it into my into my uh room because I'm gonna try to set it up for, you know, streaming on camera. And uh you know, it's not gonna be an everyday thing, it's just gonna be a, a sometimes thing. Um, because you know, I still like doing the whole m minimalism thing. But, uh, oh my God, like moving. All right. So again, it's not finished cause I still have to decorate and stuff, but this is what the place looks like right now. And, uh, like I, you know, I still gotta, you know, put up some transformers, maybe some alcohol and whatnot, but, um, yeah. I think it uh I think it's coming together well. And I will have you know that I spent a grand total of about two hundred and twenty dollars on all of that furniture. Like all that, you know stuff back there. Viker, good to see you, man. Hey Spark Blog. Oh, Winston, it's a, it's a lie. It's all a lie. Okay. So that back piece, that super large back piece with the sign, that was 160 and the side pieces were like $37 together. Like, I've spent more on an Andromeda, you know? All right, we're back. Moon, good to see you, man. Lie down. I'm already. And biker, the the jazzes. Oh, oh no, oh no, oh no. Okay, I'm good. That uh, and I'm not good. I'm not good. Oh God, please let me move. Okay, okay, there we go. Ooh. Yeah, Andy. You know, I wake up thirsty every single day, and it's because of my meds. Hey, Moonraker. Yeah, silver birds. That's how I felt this morning. Oh, like, I, I am so beat up from moving furniture all weekend. I also bought some plates. Um, I bought this massive set of dinnerware. I'm going to assume it's from the 70s, because they're all decorated in fruit. Like, you know, it's all textured and whatnot, and there's, like, ten pieces to each, like, you know, like, the full plate size, the bowl size, the mini plate size, and there's some sort of serving cup. Uh, Moon, hold on. Let me check. Hold on. Moon, let me, let me check Logitech Hub right quick. I had to unplug my, uh, had to unplug my microphone and it likes to do this thing where it defaults back to stereo. 
Hold on. Okay, I should be coming more straight on, but I'm gonna change it back to cardioid. And you tell me how I sound. Alright, Moon, is this better? Am I no longer coming out of just the right speaker? That's better? Okay. Alright, much, much better. And Frizzle, as far as the sale goes, they've got a small one right now, but it's mostly for, um, starter ships. AJ, good to see ya. And you know, Winston, I will take budget posh. Like, it's posh, but it's a lie. It's like, look, look at my wood furniture. Also, I'm still... Technically poor. <laughs> oh, thank you, Winston. We'll tell you what. A couple of days, I'll actually turn on the camera once I've got things set back up, and you can, you can see what a lie it is. Hey, snakes. So we'll go grab our ship. Drink some water. Water, water, water. Water's great, guys. You should drink more water. You know, Coyote, I, uh, I was thinking about doing that with the merch line. I actually, I picked up a hat at the, uh, Smithsonian that just has, like, a Triceratops skull on it, and I'm, I'm quite partial to it. It's a nice hat. Honestly, Xfinity, I'd wait till either 318.2 or 319. They're going to rush a little bit of 319 for the end of May. Or just make it a 318.3. Like, right now, I'm pretty sure there's going to be a wipe when point two drops, so I would, uh, oh dear. I would wait for that, but, I mean, that should hopefully be sometime this week or next week. And Jack, good to see ya. And hopefully everything is running okay. Like, I'm pretty sure I hooked everything up all right. I mean, AJ, you could easily argue that. Welcome you could easily argue that. System. And then someone will be like, no, it's, uh, it's, uh, it's, it's, you know. See? Thank you, Raymond. Thank you, dude. Raymond's drinking water. I want you guys to be more like Raymond. Drink some water. Be hydrated. Hail hydrate. Vehicle selected. Stand by. Thank you for visiting your vehicle has been delivered to the following locations. Whatever your transaction. You know, Muzz, I can believe that. I can believe that. And Squirrel, did I say hi, man? I don't know if I said hi, but just in case I missed you. It's good to see you, man. I hope things are going good for you. All right, still no barista, but that's fine. I'll just drink some soda. I, I said, there we go. Server FPS must be, uh... Ugh, yeah, okay, never mind. It's six! No, Xfinity, that is fair. Space coffee can be quite nice. I just, uh, you know what? I'm gonna, I'm gonna put this right there. That way, not hitting the server. I think we're just going to do more trade lanes today, Squirrel. See if we get hit again. Whoa. Whoa. 
I look at that. There's no liquid in there. Fidelity ruined. Fidelity. Your personal belongings are your personal belongings. Hey, hey, kid. <laughs> Heck yeah, kid. Thank you, man. I, oh, okay. Like, you know, money-wise, it was actually fairly cheap for what all it is. It's just... Oh my god. This furniture is so heavy, man. I... I... I am shot. I am shot. Like, my arms and legs just feel... Like refried rubber bands. Maz, it's, uh, I mean, I, I just got started, but it feels like it's going to be a, a day of delays. How nice to you get the data back. Hey, movies. Oh, GT, it was. I had one piece start to slide off the dolly. The back part is actually three different pieces that go together, but the way they hook up is super janky. I may have partially, like, broken some wood on one. Oh, movies, aren't we all, man? Aren't we all? Let me up. There we go. But yeah. Honestly, movies, the reason they did it this way is because they wanted more people testing the PU. And since a lot of people weren't playing because of wipes, yeah. That's why they opened it up. Yeah, CGT, I don't wanna... I don't wanna do that, that's for sure. Uh-oh. I also probably need to recalibrate Toby. Actually, uh, if you don't mind, give me... Give me just a moment. I'm actually going to do that right quick. So if you see things going crazy, that's why. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Uh, uh -huh. One second. I'm just going to be in Toby settings right quick. Just the, you know. Recalibrate this. Because you should do it every single time you move around. And, uh, there we go. Calibration successful. Wait, good to see you, man. Hey, Peaks. Hey, Hack, it's been forever, man. That's weird. My button for Toby isn't, uh, working. And I slam into the door. Oh no, another weapon system. Good thing it's all stuck. Ah, whatever. 
Check Toby in here. Yep, Toby. Huh. Weird. GT, I'm gonna try. I have to get set or used to the setup all over again. Oh, so that sounds nice. I had some Denny's the other night. Because it was close to where I was picking up the furniture from. And they've got a, a slam burger. It's a burger with an egg, hash browns, bacon, and a beef patty. And it was wonderful. Ed, good to see you, man. Not so bad. Then some furniture rearranging. Now I've got to put up all my transformers. I thought about putting, like, some alcohol in the background instead, but I feel like... I don't know. It's not like I drink it that much anyway. Alright, while we climb, I can at least check my keybind. Wait, I'm an idiot. It's not my numlock being on, is it? Let's find out. Nope. It's just not wanting to track. Odd. Toggle enabled. Yes. Offsets, yes, yes. Disable seated, no. Disable during FPS. Okay, so all of those are correct. Hmm. That is concerning. Hey, Ruminator, not too bad. Not too bad. Having an issue with Toby not working, but... wonder if we slot that into a different uh, keybind. It'll do something. Wait, maybe not F2. That is my map, isn't it? Yeah, something is throwing it off. <sighs> I'll have to figure out what setting that is and go chase that down. That'll be fun. Oh, well. Oh, squirrel. I gotta get better at bunkers, man. It's been so long. I have touched a bunker. I uh, can it should be. I know a lot of people have just been getting in from the right side so they don't get hit. But so hard to uh you know make that your your thing to do when for years you've just been automatically getting in from the left side. And Daniel, good to see you, man. I'm glad you finally get to play again. Hey, wait. Really, Wade? How long ago was that? Yeah, Moon, like it's powered on. Um, I mean, I'll just mess with it after, you know, 
Star Citizen. Like, it's powered on, and it looks like it's detecting. And I'm toggling, but it's not actually moving. I'm gonna say it might have something to do with me calibrating it in-game. Wade? Wade? Is today your birthday, Wade? Hey, Arcturus. Yeah, I'm gonna bet it's because I calibrated it while I was in game. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna chalk it up to that. Worst comes worse, if I get a 30k, I'll just restart the game. If that is the case, though, I am gonna put it back on my old keybind, because, you know. At this point, that's just where I know it. Oh, what do we got? Oh, it's an... It's an what? <laughs> Torpedo burrito. Thank you, Coyote. Thank you, man. Sorry, it's it's been a few days that actually made me. It gave me a little shot of adrenaline there. <laughs> Thank you, Coyote. Whoo. Whoo. Too bad. Good to see you, man. It, uh, I think it's going all right today. I mean, granted, we've only been in for a few minutes, but see things. Uh, we'll see how things go. But Wade, Wade, it's your birthday. You know what we gotta do. Hey, Livio. <clears throat> oh, it is taking me forever to exit the sea. There we go. You know, in Revenant, I would like to mess around uh, with, uh, with variables. VB, you know, V, what is it? VBKs, VKBs. Uh, Daniel, it is Wade's birthday. <clears throat> oh, Wade, you know I gotta. You know I gotta. All right. Sing along if you know the words. Um, <clears throat> if you don't want to sing along, I completely understand. Time to put in those earplugs. <clears throat> Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Wade. Happy birthday to you. And many more. You have to excuse me, Wayne. I feel like I'm still waking up. Like I'm still getting my voice going. <clears throat> it was a, it was a little scratchy. I feel like I feel like I owe you a uh, another one. You'll have to. You'll have to. Let me field another one for you later on. And maybe we'll just you know. Get you a uh, a uh, a gift card or a or a pet frog or something. Hey, Pagan! Good to see ya. Good to see ya, man. How are you? You know, Winston, I would take that. I would take that position. Actually, you know, I'm gonna I'm gonna say no because it's called Star Citizen. It's supposed to be a space game. But it seems like every time you load it up. They've got some new update that doesn't take place in space. So 
So I was like, guess what, guys? We're going underground. We're going to make a cave. Like, okay, that's weird, but all right. It's like, guess what, guys? In our space game, we're going to have underground facilities. And you're like, uh, okay. Hey, and I'm glad to hear it, man. I'm glad to hear she's recovering. I mean, like, you gotta watch out for that cane, though. Um. You know, cane, that's a... The bludgeoning object right there. But I'm glad to hear that she is... Doing better. I don't know any Get Well songs, but if you happen to come across one, I'll sing it for her. We can, we can make one. Time to get well, Miss B. Time to get well, Miss B. Time to get well, Miss B. So you can beat up Pagan Lennox Geek. We'll have to, we'll have to workshop some of those lyrics. And you know, Alphonse, you've got a point there. Like, I know, I know that's a fun well, actually, but I guess you kind of got a point there. I just, you know, like a lot of space operas don't really, like, space is there, but it's kind of a backdrop. Hey, 60s. Why am I, right, right, because... There we go. All right, so we've got a cutlass out and about. Something on the horizon that I can't target. Uh, Daniel, sometimes turning your weapons off and back on will fix that. You know, Bobby, I've heard that a lot um, about the controller setups. That's honestly one of the reasons I'm kind of scared to, you know, ever go away from mouse and keyboard. I just... It's so easy to use. Uh, Muzz, I'm in the PU. I'm in the Pepe Le PU. away sometime we go uh um, was running pt or pu so it's point one Where is it? Where is it? Where is my... There it is. There it is. No, Arcturus? Like, okay, okay, Arcturus. You ever watch Orville? You ever watch Orville? You ever watch Gordon Malloy pull off all those funky dunk maneuvers? He flies with a keyboard. Like, I cannot tell you how vindicated I felt when I saw the Orville. I'm like, wait a second. He's flying with a keyboard. Like, you want to talk about some representation? I felt so vindicated. Like, look at that guy flying with a keyboard. Heck yeah. Heck. Oh, uh, wow. That is. Oh, an Aurora. What 
Well, I'm curious if you ever get a chance to watch it. I will say that the first season is probably the worst in terms of like slapstickiness, but it is a wonderful, wonderful show. And the first season is still good. It's just it builds up higher and higher as it goes. Um, it is both a parody and a love letter to shows like Star Trek and uh, is a wonderful watch. And Ingo, good to see you, man. How is, how is Germany right now? Is it cool? Is it warm? You guys are probably hitting springtime. And Bobby, that's fair on the controller. That's what Crumpet started the game with, was a uh, controller. Yes, Arcturus, yes. Yeah, that show. Because, like, once he got it off box and it went to Hulu, he was able to do whatever he wanted to, and he went more Star Trek style with it. Because, you know, it wasn't no longer on TV, it was on streaming. So he could do whatever he wanted to, and uh, he went more like those classical Star Trek style episodes. Oh, Moon, that sounds so wonderful. Sounds like something you got a picnic basket for and just, you know, go sit on a hill and eat like a stick of bread. Maybe some... I don't know, what, are, what do people eat? You know, GT, you're not the first person to, to tell me that. I'm wondering what's causing that. Whee. And we're now. Yeah! Cheese sandwiches, there we go. Cheese sandwiches. Still can't fix the ship, that's fine. You know, Astro Man, a chocolate beer sounds. Hmm. I don't know how I feel about that. Like, alcoholic chocolate. That seems like a weird combo. I want to try that. And Pagan, we could be. We could be. 16 months. That is forever, man. Thank you. Thank you, GT. Thank you, Jaeger. I'm just gonna leave this right here. Yeah, Ingo, the the server FPS has been very bad recently. Um, very bad. And it makes it take for ever for things to uh oh, pagan. Torpedo burrito. oh thank you pagan thank you bud although i'm gonna tell you right now i am angry at the cats they have earned my my consternation they have earned every bit of like aggravatedness that they possibly could so Pagan, I don't, I don't know um, what all I've told you. I am, I've recently, uh, I went to an estate sale on Friday, and found a bunch of furniture to set up for stream room, for you know streaming with a camera. Hey Metzer. And uh, here, hold on. Let me just. I don't have the room fully built out yet, but uh, this is what it. This is the furniture. Now, I got this stuff for cheap. I think, like, all of the all the stuff behind the desk, I think was maybe $220, including a cabinet that you can't see on, on, in the, whatever you call it. Anyway, very cheap. Super cheap. Like, the side bits were $37 together. The problem was, 
it was heavy. And the entire time we were moving stuff in, the cats are crawling under things, inside the shelves, like, oh no, I'm gonna drop it. Suddenly, cat is under it. And, and just, uh, constant, constantly. And then they had to crawl, like, you know, into a chair and get on top of it. And, oh no, cat doesn't know how to get down because cats are dumb. Oh, yeah, like, I am super excited. Like, I could, I could, I could stream it right now with camera, but, um... I still want to get some transformers and whatnot set up. You know, I don't want to be so bare. Yeah, so Ingo, the way... Okay, so the reason why, like, Loreville doesn't really have anything. Unless you're talking about, you know, streaming possibility. What? Did that just fall off? Oh, see, Coyote, they have that. It's just, you know, we're moving new things. But, um... Yeah, they're just... They're not... Mm. It was just constant. And then I had one climb me. And, you know, I'm made of flesh. And that was incredibly painful. Yeah, Moon, oh, I haven't shaved or anything, man. I gotta, I gotta, I gotta get my, uh, I gotta get my, uh, my good looks on. Not to mention, I'm also waiting for a, uh, a windscreen thing for my microphone, because right now the one I'm currently using blocks like half my face. Oh well, yeah, Coyote, because we had the box of the plates came in. Well, let me buy a burrito. Let me buy... There we go. Man, I could really go for a burrito. Wade, really? Really, Wade? You're gonna... You're gonna... You're gonna do that to me? You're gonna do that? Oh, that's that's peer pressure, Wade. That's peer pressure. That's that's vile. That's uh, that's vicious, man. Thank you for visiting our court. Whoa! Whatever oh, look at him ride the pony. Yeah, Tsume, this this server is going to go out. Oh, it's a birthday. Tell you what, Wade, is that is that what you want? Is that what you want for your birthday? Is that what you really want? God, I should have shaved. I feel I feel slovenly. I feel like I feel like the guy I feel like I look like the guy who has opinions about comic books. And the thing is I do have opinions about comic books. I just hate them a bit the the stereotype. <laughs> Uh. Oh, Moonraker, it's a thing that I do because I can't grow a decent beard, so I have to just hide what little facial hair I can grow by, by shaving it. Oh, Ingo, we always try to be happy here. And if you're not happy, we'll do our best to cheer you up, or at the very least, hear you out. Yeah, Pagan, that's it. That's it. Tell you what, Wade. Tell you what. Could you give me a late birthday present till tomorrow? That'll let me get everything finished setting up. Because, like, right now I've got my cabinet set up and about two transformers. 
and uh, I'd like to get the rest of them set up. All right, all right. How about that? We'll do it. We'll do it tomorrow. We'll go. We'll go off and on. Ah, oh, yes, of course, Pagan. Like Fabio. I'm the kind of guy your mother's romance novels warned you about. Ah, yes, Ingo. We'll, we'll definitely do a stream like that. Yes. That'll be on, uh... We'll do that on the Orange YouTube. Yeah. I mean, that is true, Wade. It's just nice to be able to do, like, finger guns directly at the camera. What not? Come on. There we go. I didn't just sell off all my... Nope, there it is. All right. All right, we are... Come on, let me, let me go. Let me go. You know, Coyote, that's not a bad idea. Not the worst idea in the world. Uh, Ingo at the time. My current time is 3.38 p.m. There you go, Daniel. Use the reclaimer. Not uh, it's not bad. You know, Wade, I'm almost tempted. That sounds so fun. Tell you what. They've got a really nice sound wave mask. I could uh, I could buy one of those and just get a voice changer and uh, stream games as a sound wave. Metzer, yes, in PTU they're supposed to be fixed, but right now in PU they are um, few and far between. Hey, you're good, Ingo. You don't gotta apologize. I mean, that's what chat's for. Like, literally, that's that's what, like, the whole chat area is is for. It's like no, no chatting here. Relevant information only. I'm gonna tell you guys though, if I ever gotta move this furniture again, I'm just I'm just gonna save up and hire people. I'm gonna do that. So much easier. Oh the pain. Oh the pain. Especially because it's all on carpet. James, what about, uh, what about, like, R&Rs or, like, the Yala belt? Are you getting any luck there? Or have you just been testing air and Halo?
All right. Uh, Hellhawk, we are currently live. BTU is, uh... Like, I'd be willing to test it, but... I like to mess around with live. I mean, GT, yes, but I don't plan on opening the drapes, so... They're just gonna stay closed. Cause like, believe me, TT, down here in Arkansas, like, sun? Blah. I get plenty of sun the moment I step outside. And, uh, the least amount of sun coming in, aka heat, the better. I wonder if it's just really slow, and I need to sit on the screen for like 20 seconds. Wow. That was almost right. And James, that's fair. I know a lot of people have been predatory on stuff. Hey, Mad. Hey, Apple. Hey, Robert. Nice rain. How was it so far? One day I'll get one. One day. Alright, and away we go. James, that I can believe, man. Like, scanning rocks has always been a little... Odd. Awful. Barely functional. Hey, Simmy. Nice, Hans. Let me know how you like him. I think we're going to go to Crusader. Mess around over that way. Come on. <coughs> Excuse me. Yeah, you can go like the six degrees of freedom sticks. Did Sublight ever end up getting theirs out? I wonder. I'm gonna I'm gonna look that up while we're in quantum. And with it being sunny, that should be a direct shot to Crusader. Make the jump. There we go. 
Matt, I did. I did. I feel like I was being a little bit gatekeepy with it initially because I saw it on the uh, on the early release. But uh, you know, it's a fun movie. Like, I feel like they could have done a little bit more. But, um, you know, as far as D&D &D movies go, it's definitely been a lot better than what we've had. Um, I think they did well. I think they did well with it. I think they definitely made it, you know, approachable for just about everybody while having tons of stuff like references and Easter eggs for people who follow D&D, &D, both, you know, like rules and uh, a lot of the lore. Oh, yeah. I mean, there's a lot of cheap jokes. Like, they basically just tried to make the D&D version of Guardians of the Galaxy. I will say that Simon the Sorcerer was probably my favorite character. Just because, you know, as he's going through spells, it sounds really just like a player being like, Oh, yeah, no, I can't. I can't do that. I can't. I can't do that. Like, I do feel like the the bard could have actually done, I don't know, bard stuff. Like, literally, the bard does nothing the whole movie. He's just there. And yeah, and Shark, like, like, what was his name? Velk? Zink? I think Zink. Like, no charisma whatsoever just min max stats like oh i don't get this and it's like this guy is a rock i have seen people play this exact character he is a rock you know robert there were no dice roll actually oh robert thank you for reminding me i need to go get my giant d20 from oh my god please tell me hold on i gotta go Hold on. Hold on. Um, please tell me they still have it. Please tell me it's not out of stock. Please tell me. No! No, I missed it. Oh. Dang it. No. Okay. Okay. AMC had this as a popcorn holder. It's a giant D20 popcorn holder, and I missed it. I forgot to order it, like, a week ago. And... Ah. Oh. Ah. Dang it. You think they'll come back in stock? Oh, yeah, Apple, but they'll be, like, expensive. You know, Moonraker, he actually did sing a song. And thank you, Erasmus. I appreciate it, man. Uh, Ingo, I have not seen that channel. Exactly, Hans. Like, I was, I was moving too much furniture. That's it. Yeah, man. Tell me about this poster. I will tell you guys, though. I plan on going bankrupt when all the Transformers stuff comes out. For, uh, for Rise of the Beasts. I know you guys have heard me talk about this movie incessantly. But that's just... You know, sometimes... You, you look at something on the horizon. And you, you put all of your stock in that. To keep yourself going. That's what Rise of the Beast is for me right now. Oh, Granulus. I want... I... I... Whew, I gotta track one down. I gotta find one on eBay. I have got to find one. I, uh... I gotta have it on display. 
Yeah, AJ, is that yours? Like, you know, sometimes, like, you know, to keep yourself going, you just have to set a goal. Just something to throw yourself across the finish line for. A hundred bu- Oh, Robert, real- Oh, no. You know what? I'll just- I'll just- I'll just call up the theater in Little Rock and see if they have any. If they do, I'll just, you know, I'll just make a drive up there. It'll cost me, like, what? Ten dollars on gas? I'll see if they have any left. Yeah, like the bard did singing. I guess I don't know. Does that really count as inspiration? I just you know he didn't stab anybody. There was very little flirting on his end. Like they did lean definitely into like the D and D faction system, like Harpers and whatnot. Yeah, Moon, have a good night, man. Sleep well. Yeah, see, Robert, I want the popcorn too. Like, for a hundred dollars, I better get pop. Yeah, kid, have a good night, man. Same to you, GT. Good luck with the rest of the day. I... Ooh, I'm trying to figure out what I want to eat later. I am quite hungry. I had, like, some bits of fruit for breakfast, but that's just making me hungry now. Drive is now off. I'm gonna gamble. I'm gonna go to Bountiful Harvest. Oh look, there's a Gladius. Exactly, Ingo. Burrito. Oh, Ken. <laughs> Thank you, Ken. Thank you, man. You know, I gotta add in more now. I gotta... I gotta figure out how to... How to do more stuff. Yeah, thank you, Ken. And that's still gonna hit. And what? There we go. Sorry, is he is he running away? I'm sorry, Ingo. I'll be I'll be getting started earlier. In a few days, hopefully. I've just been having to move around stuff. Oh, this is why I really need Toby. Man, you don't miss it till it's gone, I tell you. There we go. Now the question is, what is going on with this Andromeda? Uh, Pagan, I was recalibrating it while I in Star Citizen, so I can't seem to turn it on and off. I think just restarting Star Citizen will fix it. I just, uh... have to restart Star Citizen. You know, I I wonder. I wonder. Yeah, Raymond, go get a bite. 
Get some food, man. Tell us all about it. That's it, huh? No water? No cargo? Alright. Should be safe, then. At least from this guy. that I get uh, I get got while inside here yeah I'm going mad Toki good to see ya how's the rest of the band these days I've got a small one Oh, large. Of course, these things get farmed for guns all the time. Looks like I was too late to this rodeo. Ah, well. Buy our cargo and get out of here. What do you mean, crewmate? Oh, hey. Max inventory. Look at that. That is what we like to see. Oh, yeah, crow. Come on. Come on. Change around. Let me buy the max inventory distilled spirits. I will say the server FPS is not helping. Oh, Ingo, he just means like how long it takes to get from the, the seat to exiting the ship. Because, you know, the Caterpillar, it's like a good 30 seconds. Come on. Come on, let me buy the cheap alcohol. Guys, I don't think I'm going to be able to do this. Maybe, maybe that's why they've got max inventory. Because no one can actually buy. Alright. We're gonna go slow. We'll let it engage. There we go. Let it load up balance. There we go. Select an inventory. 
caterpillar not touch anything. Probably still going to be disappointed, but... Come on. You can do it. Maybe it can't. Yeah, Muzz, this is bad. Like, I don't want to blame server FPS because I've been able to buy elsewhere. Squirrel, I don't know about that, man. Like, we've been waiting a good, what, two, three minutes now? Like, I could... Like, I can sell just fine. Always, someone bringing in medical supplies. Hey, Sykes. Yeah, Hans, you know what? I think we're going to go elsewhere. Maybe try the one on Hicks. Not Hicks, uh, I'm selling. Shadow, how you doing? Oh, no, Crow. We're just going to leave. Like I can hear another engine. Yeah, Pagan? Oh, not too bad, Shadow. I am worn out and beat up, but, uh... Otherwise, okay. And yeah, Ingo, like, I mean, I know they had that issue with Street Fighter 2 back in the day. Let alone, you know, stuff like this. Yeah, we'll just go to selling. Maybe be some free salvage, though. Landing. Think anybody's actually buying at Tram and Myers these days? Hey, no worries, Shadow. I got a timer set for it. I got about uh, 50 minutes left. Go take yours, man. Besides, it's late night. Can't be going about without taking meds. Really polite character. Hmm. 
wasn't guile, was it? I mean, he just always said things like, go home and be a family man. I don't find that to be particularly polite. Oh, my. Set me up. How could you? How dare you? <laughs> man, Crow, I'll tell you, I miss not taking him, man. I miss not taking them. Drive is now on. I didn't go, that's fair. Yeah, Muzz, you like those beautiful bugs? Let family fall. Two K's not that bad, Muzz. Shoot, I have to stream in two K because my internet can't handle four K. I wish it could, but living in a third world country. Apple, it is a pretty third world country. You get that one. It's just, I like the internet and it's very internet averse. Oh, so what is that? Is that someone's remains? Looks like what used to be a Pisces. Get, get, get out of here. Scoot. Get on. There we go. Ingo, I would love to give you all my meds, but they're very expensive. Very, very expensive. All right, let's go. Hopefully buy some cargo. Eh. 
Hey, and ours, ours is spelled this way for a reason. We have we have reasons. Honestly, Pagan, it's not a bad idea. I'm gonna check this thing right quick just for inventory, but um Ah, I can't access the... That makes sense. That makes sense. Hey, Brace! Alright, let's see if we can actually buy cargo here. Doubt it, but worth a shot. Come on. Come on. Yeah, see, this one works. Well, it might not work for me, but it's been working. Ah, uh, there we go. 434 a unit. Ugh, gross. Gross! Let's buy the food and move on. Well, you see, Ingo, we actually get a, a mention in the theme song for Carmen San Diego. When they say they never Arkansas her steal the Mekong from the jungle. I was so excited as a kid. It's like, wow, Arkansas got mentioned in something. How cool is that? Also, have you guys been coming across loot boxes? Like the red and black ones. I just haven't seen a lot of them, but... Maybe I'm just too slow. Maybe everyone's beating me to them. Move all that. You know, Muzz, I have no idea. It might be with point two. Ha-ha! Look at that. Right as I... Right as I talk about it. Ooh, it's all devastators. A Uber? Come on, nobody... Nobody wants the tickle pistol. Ugh, whatever. I guess I should be grateful. It's just... The Uberev, you know? Come on. Yeah, Apple, it sure is. I... Uh, uh... Well, that's not how that works. That's not how that works at all. Hey, Death, uh, we're currently live. Live, live, live. Exactly, Toki. It's like, I'll take it, but... Only because I'm hitting the move all button. Yeah, Death, not, uh... Not too bad. Like, I'm able to play. I mean, it is Star Citizen, but I am able to play. 
Really, Brace? You'd think this would be the last places you'd find them. What with, you know, everyone going there. Alright, private property, Terra Mills. We're gonna skip on Terra Mills. Briska. So, like, the thing I wanna know is, like, what are we supposed to do with all these security posts now? Actually, let's go tram. See how much their titanium is going for. I mean, Ingo, you could. There's plenty of plushies out there. Buy and sell people's Picos. Oh, it sucks. I'm sorry, man. Yeah, like, I feel like free flies are the worst time to play because it's basically there to stress the server and it's like, man, I sure don't want to spend $45 on this mask. You have to be like, no, wait, my friend, person whom I'm convincing to get this so I can get a Merlin or whatever. I promise there are times that it acts better. Today's not that day. But uh, there are days that it does act better. <laughs> ah, Matt. You know, I'd like to actually make a little box plushie. That'd be fun. And Brace, I'm not too worried about it. Because, I mean, a lot of it was just, you know, Ubero. And Devastators and stuff. Nice, Sykes! get the uh to get the Merlin out of them and make him use a referral code man you know I haven't been to Tremon Myers in a very long time yeah you can go I mean it'd probably just be like a little yellow box Oh, Flaky. Flaky, Flaky, Flaky. Thank you, man. I did. I did. Here, uh, let me, let me. Hold on. Let me land right quick, Flaky. Ah, Torpedo Burrito. Torpedo Burrito. I did. All right, so Flaky. I, um. I don't have the room fully set up yet. Which is why I'm not, you know, doing cam stream at the moment. But, uh, this is, this is what it looks like right now. I still gotta get all my, you know, transformers and whatnot set up around the, uh, the room. But, uh, that is currently what the, uh, the room looks like. So, yes, I got the cabinet. The two side cabinets on each side, those were $37 together. Honestly, I think I spent more, almost as much on the U-Haul as I did the furniture. It was 220 total, I think, for the furniture and, uh, like, all the, all the cabinets together. So, I think tomorrow... We'll actually be able to do it with camera if you guys are okay with seeing like that won't be every day 
just every now and then because I like the minimalist setup. You know, I do this every time I get out here. It's fine. I can get back in. I know, Flaky. It feels it feels great. Thank you, Better. Uh, yeah, it's like they might it might take them a little bit longer to get it. Usually for the newbie accounts, for whatever reason, they uh, they tend to you know go a bit slower on getting them their rewards, which I feel like they should be the ones who get it first. And Pagan, don't tempt me. I will I will get annoying with it. Grace, I feel you there. Death, I do not. If anyone has a smoking jacket they'd like to send me, I'll uh, I'll gladly take it. You know, um, I do I do have my Drake jacket, which is, I mean, it's technically a smoking jacket because most Drake ships are on fire after heading for repairs. But uh, you know, it's not a uh, a recreational smoking jacket come on come on what do we have Ugh. you know when I say smoking jacket it might have like cigarette burns on it welding burns What I'll do, I'll put on I'll put on my Drake jacket tomorrow. How about that? Actually, actually, how about I put on my CIG hoodie tomorrow? Yeah, we'll do that. Like, hello. I'm not a CIG employee, but I dress like one. That's it, Pagan. That's it. Well, I mean, Flaky, they didn't have any Drake furniture. Like, okay. Okay, that's it, Flaky. The estate sale, like, the more... Whoops. The more ramshackle the furniture was, the more expensive it was. Like, there was this one table. It was round. Glass table. And, like, the glass was being held up by, like, four lions on a middle pedestal. And that was $1,200. But my side cabinets with the lighting, those were thirty-seven dollars together. Ooh, seven fifty-five. Gross. You know what? We're gonna buy it anyway. Bye, 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 birdie. That's true, Flaky. We don't have a lot of those around here. That's it, Wade. I'm gonna start streaming with that, and they'll just they'll they'll, they'll call me up like, "Hey, uh, we're gonna need you to not do that," and then and then I'll just go even more ham with it. I'm like, as an official spokesperson for CIG, I can confirm that the Drake Lobster will be entering PTU next month. And that, uh, by the way, the Banu Merchantman will actually be going down in price. You can trust me from my CIG hoodie. All right, let's figure out how we're going to do this. We bought all the cargo. Thinking we might actually have to jump in from a... Uh, Actually, no, I think we can do it from there. Have to get the angle right. Haha! Oh, yeah, movie's super inaccurate. Yeah, Wade, like. Oh, man, I've already missed April Fools. That would be wonderful as April Fools. 
I'll have to get me a piece of tape and write not on it and write it right above where it says CIG. Hey, none, yeah, of course. Forever and always. Forever and always. Yeah, movies, it can be fun. You should try it out. All right. What if we got risky? What if we tried to sell all this at Brio's? Just for fun. Oh, Flaky, you and me both, man. Like, I love trading. But sometimes I just want to go, hey man, give me a load. Don't really care where it goes. I just want to go space trucking. Oh yeah, Sykes. Um, they'll definitely be available at the end of May. And uh, the <coughs> pirate caterpillar is always available. Well, nothing yet. We're going to do a flyby. We're going to go check it out. We're going to go see how awful it is. Come on. Come on. There we go. You know, Death, you're you're right. You're right. You might be onto something there. Quantum drive is now off. Yeah, Artex. You think I should uh, up my my fashion? All right, Brios, where are you? Oh, I wish you would stop doing that. Yeah, Sykes. Back in the day, you could, but not anymore. Embrace, I get it, man. Like, if you go back in time, you can get them for super cheap, but the price on them just keeps ballooning. That's a beautiful sunset. Sunrise, sun, sun something. So what we're going to do... Oh, a blade, huh? A set for right there. We'll set a course for Art Corp. No, no Art Corp. Microtech. There we go. That'll at least let us uh, boogie out. Oh yeah, movies. They'd love to do that. Blakey, I know that feel. All right, all right. Let's see if we can sneak this, uh, this load of cargo in. Hey, Phaedrus. Ah, oh, movies, you're good. I just don't like doing it, um, you know, Audibly, because I know a lot of people like to watch it work or whatever.
Yeah, Phage, it's good to see you, man. past it. You know, Flaky, that's actually what I was thinking. I love the Terrapin, and I wish it had some sort of alternate version. Phaedrus, I hope, man. I really hope. Uh, Ingo, I do. Sometimes, anyway. A lot of, uh, a lot of raft bits out here. Like someone's been selling drugs. They wouldn't be abusing a system, would they? Oh, Ingo, I do it a lot too, man. You pretty much have to spam that stupid ping. Hey, bro. Yeah, so far. There's a high chance of getting blown up while we're here. We're gonna find out. Like, should you land where several corpses already are? Probably not. That's a dumb thing to do. But with wipes, you know, being readily apparent, I don't think it matters. Oh, come on. Do I have to put my gun? Oh, no. There we go. Come on. Let me select an option. Oh, yeah, Flaky. It's, uh... One of my favorite weapons. Oh, Matt. Oh. Oh. Watch. I'm going to get blown up. Not because I was bad, but because it took forever for this thing to load. But yeah, Flaky. That's why I pulled my knife out. Or my knife out. I want to cut off the top. Come on. Come on. Lego. Lego. Oh, no one shattered it yet. That's right, Pagan. We're slashing prices. <laughs> Everything's on sale. Prices are being slashed. Oh, Lou, I'm just having fun with live. No real particular reason. There we go. All right. We're going to sell all of our titanium. We're going to sell 200 titanium. Hey, T-Rex. Well, turns out, uh, I'm gonna have to go sell the rest of my titanium elsewhere. Yeah, Matt, sir, have a good night, man. Good luck with work. Oh, Phaedrus, Phaedrus. Phaedrus, you want to see the, uh, 
You want to see the furniture set up for the uh, for the stream room? It's not finished yet. I still have to decorate, like you know, all the figures and whatnot. But uh, I got all the big stuff moved in. That is painful. And it should be ready by tomorrow. Why, why do I keep pulling my knife? Oh, movies. No. No. Yeah, Phages. Uh, let's see. Make sure I've got the right one. There it is. Yeah. I should have it set up by tomorrow. If you guys are interested. I won't be used every day. But, you know. Be fun. And I think we've got just enough to make it back to our court. Oh, Phaedrus, it was so cheap. Probably because... I'm going to be honest, that, that furniture is probably going to destroy my floor. Like, it's a carpeted room. But that stuff is so heavy, man. Like, all of that together was like $220. Uh, yes, Hans, yes. I have, actually. I've done, like, the lighting setup and whatnot. Um, I think I've got it as good as I'm gonna get it. Like, I'm no lighting engineer, but... Hey, Dragnos! I said we'll give it a, we'll give it a whirl... ...tomorrow. Maybe late tonight, I don't know. Because uh, I'd also like to do, you know, that Lego Optimus Prime build. Movies, that's fair. Now, you know, I put on a bunch of weight since they got me on those uh, immunosuppressants and steroids and whatnot. So if you're expecting a twink, I'm going to have to disappoint you. Because uh, my meds have made me put on the pounds. Yeah, that's it, Hans. Tell you what, I got some cardboard. I'll build me a, a giant yellow box helmet, and I'll just stream with that. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, movies. I want Jack in the Box so bad. We don't, uh, we don't have those here. They don't really exist in Arkansas. Say what I could go for, though. Some chicken pot pie. And today is Chicken Pot Pie Day. I'm thinking... I'm thinking once we, uh, whoopsie doodle. Once we wrap up the stream, I might go get some of that Chicken Pot Pie. See, Drag knows I miss those, man. Like, when I lived in Austin... Oh. Oh, that was so good! <sighs> Sorry, I'm just... I'm remembering having variety of things that you could eat, you know, like here... 
like if you don't want a burger you're pretty much out of luck like you've got wendy's burger king mcdonald's and uh sonic andy's which admittedly andy's makes a pretty good burger they're actually a, a local chain there's only about six of them um very local chain but uh you know past that it's um taco bell two mexican restaurants Tia and uh el perion Oh, hey, glad to have you back, man. And T-Rex, the kittens are doing well. Um, they're still in their box. I think next week I'm going to start plucking them out and letting them explore the house. She, uh, she has them in this really tall cardboard box. And, uh... Yeah. Yeah, no, no, Hans. Like, no, okay, so Hans, the thing is, there's this place coming in called Guti's. And it's uh, half Mexican, half Italian. Which, honestly, I feel like they missed, they missed the mark there. Like, they could have called it Que Pasta instead of, like, Guti's. But, uh, you know, it's whatever. Just don't... Wasting all these opportunities to have a... An amazing name for an Italian Mexican place. Like it could have been K Pasta, but no, we're gonna gonna call it Goodies. And uh They haven't actually finished building it yet. Like they started in like late January. Here it is. We're, like we're on the back end of April. And uh they still haven't finished moving yet. And I gotta tell you, it's annoying, because every time I drive by, I look for any sign of improvement, and I don't see it. Oh, Migs. <laughs> oh. Oh, oh, Migs, no. You want halal? Actually, you know what? You could actually probably find a couple in Little Rock. Like, what did you get out of Little Rock? It's pretty much steaks and burgers, as far as the eye can see. Portuguese steakhouse? I can get you the steakhouse, but not the Portuguese part. Um, which, honestly, was one of the things I really enjoyed about uh, being up in D.C. was just all the different variety of foods. And I'm going to be honest, 99% of the stuff I ate was like, you know, chicken fried rice, or sesame, or I had a ramen bowl. That was nice. That was amazing. Like a like an actual bowl of like real ramen. That was amazing. Now, relearning chopsticks was not. Uh, that one that one took me a while, and learning how to eat ramen with chopsticks was a thing. I never, I never figured out the egg. I just left the egg. I didn't... I was not good at picking up the egg. Uh, Sarah, there was tons of amazing sushi places up there. My issue, though, and you're, you're gonna... I'm sorry. I know I'm gonna come off like a total philistine. Since I can't smell or taste, sushi is really weird. Um... Because I get all the temperature, but none of the flavor. So, I don't really like eating it because of it being cold. I like stuff being hot. Like, the hotter, the better. And, uh, you know, sushi doesn't really follow that. I wish I could taste it so I could be like, wow, that's good. Look at that. It's got subtle umami flavors and, you know, the crunchiness of this or that pairs well, but I... I don't, so... I had, uh... Oh, yeah, Migs. I live in a place with uh, 9,000 people, man. Like, we celebrated when we got a second McDonald's. Yeah, see, movies, I don't even remember what fish smells like.
Yeah, yeah, see, Sarah, that's my issue. I have to go off texture, which, believe me, they had some great textured stuff there. And that, uh, that little Korean rice bar place that had the, the bippy, the bippy bip, the bippy bip, bip, the stuff. It's like bip, 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 map, bip, bitmap. That stuff. I'm sorry, I can't pronounce it, but it was really good. I enjoyed it thoroughly. I just can't say the word. I feel terrible. Yeah, and see, Sykes, I was still relearning all my, uh... All my stuff with that. Bipimbap. Bipim, bipimbap. Bipimbap. Is that a T-Rex? Am I getting it? Bipimbap. Bipimbap. Wee! <laughs> ah, fun. But yeah, sorry. I'm just. I'm not really good at saying bit. Bib bibim bibim bap bibim bap. B bibim bap bibim bap bibim bap. Like a bibble box. Bibim bap. Yeah, it's, uh, like, I really enjoyed it. Like, honestly, if you guys ever get a chance, I would check that place out. It's right there. I want to say off of Pennsylvania Avenue. It's a little Korean rice bar. It's basically like Chipotle, but for a rice bowl. Like, you know, like the, the whole choose your, your meats. Or lack of meat, you don't have to get meat, you know, your your sauces, your vegetables, all the other things going in it. And, uh, man, that was so good, like, what a novel idea. And just, just, you know, I want more. I desperately want more. Like, it was great, and, uh, you know, I wanted more. Oh, it was so good. And, uh, all right, all right. How many, how many truckers or former truckers we got out there? Uh, specifically America. You guys remember Iron Skillet? Like, the restaurant inside all the Petro stations? Coyote, did you just do Hanson on me? <laughs> uh oh I am stuck to that screen yeah you guys remember iron skillet at all the petros have those gone downhill because I ate a one on the way back and it just wasn't wasn't the place that I remembered you know yeah Randir. oh man like back in like early 2000s Man, I just, I remember, I remember them being more green, but I'm probably just thinking of Petro itself. But, like, the giant pancakes, and, 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 burgers, and I went to one. I went to one. On our way out, and, you know, it was right outside of Knoxville. And I just, I don't know, like, it wasn't the same, you know? What? Oh, Phaedrus, Phaedrus, Phaedrus. You gotta tell us, man. You gotta tell us, how was Waffle House? Yeah, Robert, we don't have a lot. I think we've only got maybe three or four in Arkansas. There's one in Little Rock. And it has an iron skillet. Man, I'm kind of getting hungry now. Kind of getting... Kind of getting... Hungry. Oh, Phaedrus, it wasn't, wasn't anything to write home about? What did, uh... What did you get? What did you get? 
Hey, oddball. Oh, I'm sorry, man. And AJ, congratulations. Doing taxes. Oh, yeah, no, I don't, I don't. I don't do terrible tax. I file it myself online or have to do the paper stuff. TurboTax is the reason that uh, I can't just be like, hey, government, how much do I owe you? And they could be like, 20 bucks. And I could be like, cool. Now, obviously, the 20 bucks is, you know, that's an example. Very rarely do you get away with, with that. Hey, Keeft. Ah, Phaedrus. What, uh, what sort of sandwich are we talking? Because, listen, there's some great things at Waffle House, but there's things you avoid. Like the steak. Never get a steak at Waffle House. Sorry, just don't. But if you get like a, like a sausage, egg, and cheese sandwich. Mmm, on Texas toast. Melted cheese, scrambled egg. Or get it sunny side up. With a nice slab of bacon or sausage. Or even a chicken biscuit. Oh, wonderful fluffy chicken biscuit. I'm not hot seasoned piece of grilled chicken sorry I'm uh, <coughs> losing myself <coughs> yeah yeah Robert yeah they got all franchised out I know that feel Yeah, Rander, you never, you never get the steak. That's right, Hops. Hash browns. Ah, man, I could go for some hash browns. I kind of want some waffles now. Not healthy, but man, is it satisfying. Yeah, Eric, like, the thing about Waffle House, and really Southern cooking in general, is that it ends up being incredibly tasty. One, because of our overzealous use of salt. Um, but it, it definitely is not the healthiest option. Oh, Migs, I just want the whole thing, man. I just... Just the whole thing. Like, listen, if it's warm and like, you know, something that you're not going to try to fool me as being like a delicacy or whatever, then there is a good chance I will put it in my mouth. Um, like, there are very few foods that I'm just like, oh, no. I'm a little hesitant on seafood or just water based food in general. Um, this is gonna sound dumb, but I like eating things you can pet. There's no justification for that. I just... Uh, oh, oh, uh, oh. And even then, like, vegetarian dishes. There are great vegetarian dishes I've had from various places. Just, you know, no one ever goes on about zucchini or cucumber or whatever. Oh, okay. I guess I'll just... Stay? Um... Yeah, we're just gonna stay back here. You know movies, you're right. Spectrum is salty. <laughs> oh, Phaedrus. I love eating alligator for two reasons. One, it's good. And two, like, it's just fun to eat something that can replace you on the food chain. Oh, yeah, Granios, I'm, I'm with you there. Black licorice, uh-uh, right out. Right out. 
An AJ, I haven't yet. Hopefully someone else has. And CG, what's up, man? Have a good night, Sykes. Ah, oh, Mota, come on. No. Oh, yeah, ram and alligator is a, is a dish down here. Um, it's more common towards the southern areas because, you know, that's where they're more prevalent. But um, we have an alligator farm here in Hot Springs. And, uh, you know, what they get used for and whatnot. It's, uh, it's a bit more expensive because, you know, it's, it's alligator. But uh, it's good stuff. Now arriving. Yeah, AJ. I'm probably going to be on for 30, 45 more minutes. But uh, yeah, man, go for it. I'm actually going to maybe swap caterpillars. I knocked the gun off this one. Hey, Russell. Uh, Ingo, I'm told it does. Like, not even like a... A reoccurring meme thing. It's just, it's very chicken-like. Russell, things aren't too bad. The server that I'm in is very, very slow. Yeah, we'll store that. Call this one out. That's it, Evans. Oh. You know, Evans, um I don't I don't know uh how often you listen to like the Waffle House jukebox, but um, Waffle House has its own album of songs, like multiple albums. And uh they lean hardcore into using those uh, those same adjectives. You know, one between the hash browns and two between whatever's going on in the song. And there's this wonderful song about a breakup that happens at a Waffle House. And it's called Over Easy. And it has like wonderful lyrics like, She was smothered. My thoughts were scattered. And just, just wonderful, hilarious things like that. Uh, not yet, Raymond. I've, uh, I've actually, I've only got about a minute left. And I can, I can take them. Uh, Russell, I'm on point one. I'm in live. And Ingo, you would have to, yeah, like, I, I don't know how you guys would get it, because you'd pretty much have to import the alligator. Like, you would have to... You know, they get angry. Oh, movies. You know, I kind of like that. The thing is, though, movies. Uh oh. The thing is, though, movies. Like, it would have to be like a paludarium or paludarium or however you say it. Like, you know, with water and ground, because alligator is usually more, you know, water-based. Like, once it gets on ground, it's still formidable, but, uh, it's not as, you know, like, it needs to be able to drag its opponent into its own home turf. Matt, I think you could easily put gator on pizza. Of course, movies, that's how I take my pills. All right, all right. Uh, AJ, I am in hangar. I'm going to assume seven. I don't remember calling for takeoff. Yeah, I'm in hangar seven. I'm gonna take my pills while I wait for you. If I can find them. All right, come on, one more, one more, there we go. All right, let me knock these back right quick.
Okay, that's... Ugh, ugh, Tarpeo down. And Losar down. Uh, negative AJ. I'm down at the uh, area 18. Area 18. Nice. Thank you, man. Thank you, Dots. That's that's decent. See, you guys have me hungry now. Ah, uh, and like also like delivery here is pretty much non-existent. You've got Domino's and uh, that's about it. Uh, tell you what, if you want to, AJ, meet me at, uh, SAL2 on Lyria. Oh, Oddball, have they confirmed it? Okay. Alright, let's boogie. Uh, T-Rex is, um, sorry, I, I had a bit of a coughing fit. There's a couple. Like, uh, as Phaedra said, Nomad is 25% off. I think everything else is like 10 or 15. Don't, uh, don't quote me. You know, Inga, that's what it feels like. It feels like every time I go down to, like, a, a planet, not a moon, but, like, a planet, it's always nighttime. Really, Phaedrus? They still have it for 150 more bond, huh? Neat. I mean, you know, I feel like that's kind of a big gamble, but still. Yeah, movies, that is true. That's just with all the wipes and whatnot, you know? You know, Ingo, that makes me want to go, um... Makes me want to go play more Flight Simulator. Squirrel, have a good one, man. Hope game goes well. Oh, 
Oh, that actually might be. Hey, there he is. There's AJ. Go to SAL2. There we go. Uh, negative T-Rex. This is actually the, uh, the basic caterpillar. The pirate one is more olive drab. I actually have my ghoulish green skin on that one right now. What's a nomad doing here? You know, Migs, I'm gonna go off of, uh... I don't know it as nearly as well as I know others, but I would probably go Korean. Wait, 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 hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Can I cheese it? and choose America because, you know, we just kind of take everyone else's food and mix it together anyway. Does that, does that work or is that cheesing it? I feel like that might be cheesing it. Cause I'm a big sucker for rice. But... Um... You wanna... What is, uh, what's going on? Why can't my landing gear stay down? Well, that's not good. Yeah, see, Ingo, I'm just trying to cheese it. I don't think I'm going to get away with it. He's going to actually make me do the hard question. Okay. Uh, I mean, I do like burgers, but... Is that what it was, Wade? It was a nomad. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna go Korea. I'm gonna go Korea. Maybe, maybe Japan? I mean, they fry stuff over there. I'm a big sucker for quesadillas, too. But I'm also a weenie when it comes to spice. You can put just about anything in a quesadilla. Yeah, see, Ingo, I, I had some hot brat in a while back, and I loved it, man. That was great. I mean, I could go German possibly as well. Like, I'm more of a beef and chicken kind of guy. Like, pork and I don't really mesh that well. Like, I, I do not really eat pork. Hey, Dugan. Good to see you, man. You see, oddball, that's uh that's that's a heck of a pitch, I gotta say. That's that is uh that is a that is a sale right there, but I I feel like after the review I might have to uh take my recommendation in another direction. You like potatoes. I don't know, Red Deer. I've had some before that was... Woof. <laughs> yeah, Dugan, like, that's the thing. Like, a lot of spicy food has to be prepared in a way that, you know, you enjoy it. Um, it's just, for me, it's all heat, no flavor. And I've tried to get better with spicy food, and by that, I mean, I'll get, like, a spicy chicken sandwich at McDonald's or something, but I'm not 
yeah. Uh, AJ, we might, uh, we might change to SAL5. I mean, it could just be the server. It, oof, that again, huh? Oh, I don't know, Muzz. I don't know, man. Like, I've, I've seen some of you guys' food. And it looked pretty good, but, uh, tell you what, we'll have to have, like, a, a cultural dish swap. How about that? Like that knife, AJ. Got that scavenged look. Here, let me invite you to the party. See, oddball, I'm not a I'm not a huge fan of uh, seafood, but at the same time, I've never had whale. Ah, oh, you guys are making me hungry, though. Ah, oh, oh, you gotta stop it. You gotta stop it. One more, one more run. One more run, and we'll go get some, some food. You know, Megs, I would like to see more food. It sucks that they added, like, you know... Big minis, and uh, it wasn't even the first food you could eat. Yeah, T Rex, I probably should have gone to another server. Oh, I am. Like, my stomach is doing that thing where it's like, hey, feed me. I'm going to stab you unless you feed me. Good on both. Oh yeah, movies. Buffalo wings. Whoops. Crumpet. Oh, oh, boobies. Oh, yeah, I am. Oh, I am starving. I am starving. All this food talk has me hungry. You have some roasted vegetables, too. To get better at that. Very bad at uh, cooking vegetables. Hey, Michelle. A lady. What the fuck is a lady is doing here? You know, AJ. I remember that. You guys remember? Uh, I don't know, basic use of like multi crew anything. All right. Sadly, AJ, you'll have to exit the ship with me. It's, uh, well, you know how this stuff works. Landing complete. Well, somebody's had a bad day here. Nice. Thank you, Grumpy. Alright. One last ride. One more time. And then... Find something to stuff my face with. Maybe a quesadilla. Actually, maybe a burger. There's this place here called Mel's. It's one of those, like, you know, drive-up diners. Like, you can't eat out inside. 
You have to drive up with your car and eat in your car. Just, you know, leave. And, uh, they've got some excellent stuff. Actually, they've got some speed up. Uh, Ingo, I mean, if you've already got the game, then nothing at all. But, uh... Basically, any referral code gets you 5,000 extra credits, which, you know, is nothing really in the scheme of things. Like, if you're just starting out, woohoo, some extra armor, maybe a gun. Uh, but right now, if you use a referral code between now and May 2nd, both the person that referred you and the, you know, refer E, which I guess would be you, uh, get a Merlin for free. Which is like a 20 or $25 ship. Um, it has no quantum drive. It's a snub ship. So it's not going anywhere far, but it's excellent for racing. And, you know, you could always buy a ship in-game that it could go with. Or you could upgrade it to a larger ship. But I'm not going to advocate, you know, using it to spend money. Basically, we get you an LTI token. But... That's if you don't have the game. If you already have the game, then, it, well, I can't do anything for you. Also, Ingo, I would say if you have a friend that plays the game, use their referral code first before you use mine. Because, like, I don't need a merc. It'd be nice to have, but, you know, if you got a friend that plays, use theirs first. Because, like, believe me, one, your friend will be tickled. And, like, you know, it would be nice, but I don't need it. And that is true. Like what Death Factor says. You cannot trade it or get rid of it. Oh, yeah. Base price titanium. That is true. Yeah, Crumpet got her first ever kill. In a hey, deplorable. Ah, AJ, yeah. Let me race in the fighter that for some reason has less acceleration than a 300 series. Yeah, you see movies, I used to take my bicycle to Taco Bell. And uh, those guys would actually let me ride my bike through the drive-thru. Like, I'd be sitting in line at uh, 2 in the morning on my bicycle. Toss my tacos into my, uh, my, my saddlebags. Click my bell and, uh, and ride off into the night. Oh, yeah, you have some places. Like, sir, sir, I'm gonna have to ask you to, to dismount your vehicle. And, like, the bicycle? AJ, hey, what, 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 what are you doing? I'm trying to, like, throw garbage in my ship? Yeah, you can go tacos. Oof, tacos sound good. Really, everything sounds good. I want rice. I want beans. I want those refried beans. I want the rice. Ah, collecting things, huh? God, I just want a bunch of refried beans mixed with rice. It's chicken. What is that? What does that end up being? Is that a is that a is it is that a dish? Beans, rice, and chicken. It's gotta be like a thing, right? Oh, chicken. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna have to go maybe go call up the taco truck. 
Yeah, T-Rex. I'm kind of feeling... I'm, yeah, some enchilada sounds good. See, Wolf, we don't get curry in my neck of the woods. Which is sad. I would, you know, gladly try it. Oh, yeah, movies. Ho, ho, ho. I mean, just about Billy anything. You see, crap, but I don't, I don't know if the taco truck does a burrito bowl. I have to check his menu. Uh, where is that? What did I put Google? Dear Google. Dear Google. Come here, Google. Yeah, see, Migs, I think you're selling me on this enchilada idea. Is it covered with cheese? I have to kind of go light on my cheese. What with the whole sodium thing? I mean, I guess I could just always be like, hey, man, could you go light on the cheese? And he'll be like, why? Weakly. All right, all right, all right. Here is here's the menu. Get tortas, tacos, sopas, gorditas. Is that a gordita? Is that what that says? Sorry, I'm having to zoom in. Quesadilla, burritos, flautas, stuffed tacos, carne asada. Nope, nope. Let me read the other side. Fajitas, ranchero mix. Actually, ranchero mix. I don't see any enchiladas on this uh, this menu. Sorry, I keep punching my or like hitting my uh, my microphone. Hey, Misfit. Ah, yes. Thank you. Thank you, Pedris. Yeah, Pedris got you. Well, movies, what's that? Okay. It's not my heart. It's my kidneys, you know? Like, the less salt I pump into them, the longer what I've got left lasts. So, I gotta go easy on them when it comes to sodium. And cheese is surprisingly uh, salt heavy. And like, dialysis just don't seem fun. Oh my god, I forget how big these burritos are. Actually, movies I don't, they're both bad. That's, that's the problem. Is they both were damaged at the same time. Like, they're both bleeding out. Otherwise, I'm gonna be like, yeah! I'm just, you know go all over it, but no, they both got damaged goods. Hey, hi. Good to see you, man. Oh, you got some liver problems? Man, you gotta, you gotta stay on top of those, dude. My mom was married to a guy who worked for, uh... Whoever owns Cheetos, like he had a delivery truck, and all that dude ate was Cheetos. And he had liver problems out the wazoo. Uh, James, it's actually an autoimmune disease. Uh, I was diagnosed with it uh, about a year or two back. It's called IgA nephropathy, also known as Berger's disease. Most American sounding disease but uh no it's an autoimmune disease basically what it does james is my immune system starts uh depositing a bunch of things in my kidneys that are way too big 
for my kidneys. See, kidneys act like a sieve, and you know, they kind of filter all these things out, but the immune system starts putting these little IgA cells in there, and they're way too big. And then the kidneys are like, oh no, that's too big to fit in here. And the immune system's like, I'll make it fit. So it just keeps punching holes in my in my kidneys. And uh, with those big old holes, or anything can you know, pass through. It makes them less and less useful. Oh man, it's all right, it happens, you know, like... You know, they caught it early enough where I've got time and uh, I'm on this this quasi new drug that is specific to my uh, to my disease. And for now, I don't have to pay for it. So like, you know what? Like there's parts that suck, but I'm not like, you know, allergic to my own blood or whatever. Pretty sure that's a thing. And besides, like, I can still eat tacos, so it can't all be that bad, right? Now, later on, I gotta, you know, avoid a bunch of stuff, but for now, for now, I can have tacos. I just gotta be real gentle on them. Try to preserve them for as long as possible. All right. Let's go sell, sell, sell. I mean, T-Rex, it can be about Star Citizen and food. Sometimes it's about Transformers. I don't know, movies. Like, you could argue the same thing about, like, if it looks good, how bad could it be? Yeah, Ingo. It's like, come on, man. Like, you're supposed to be on my side. Like, how am I going to get Norton antivirus as an immune system? Oh, sigh. I want to. I want to so bad. Like, I want to flip a Kraken. Like, Tide Pods. You guys ever seen Tide Pods? Like, you know, you hear the thing about kids eating Tide Pods, and you think, wow. They're idiots. And then you kind of see a Tide Pod. And you're like, wow, that actually... That is visually appealing. <laughs> oh, crap. But I gotta... I gotta... I gotta finish setting that up. I have two Transformers set up. Tonight I'm going to spend uh, putting up the rest. And I have to figure out how to position the Fallen to where he can be both threatening and having his, his face ripped off. I don't know if you guys heard that, but I just felt something big shake my house. Maybe I'm going to get a storm. Oh, God, that line. Give me your face. Like, really, Optimus? Like, that's... That's the line? Well, you see movies. Uh, in Transformers 2, when Optimus is fighting the Fallen, at the end of the fight, he literally says, Give me your face. And then rips the dude's face off. Oh, you guys heard that through the mic? Wow. I'm just gonna Google the weather right quick. That's odd. It says it's sunny. Maybe someone got, I don't know, shot at? But yeah, like they made a they made a figure of the fallen studio series figure, and uh, I wouldn't I wouldn't have touched it. I wouldn't have even looked at it. 
but it actually has the removable face feature. So you can actually remove his face. No, no earthquake. I didn't feel the ground move. Maybe the cats knocked something over. Uh, movies, if you're talking about Rise of the Beasts, the early trailer had a lot of stuff before they finished the, uh, the CGI. And it's been fixed in the later trailers. Even if the CGI sucks, I don't care, man. I'm just happy that Beast Wars is actually gonna, like, have a movie. Like, I'm gonna get to see Optimus Primal. I'm gonna, I'm gonna see, I'm gonna see Cheetor. Man, I wish they'd bring back David Kay's Megatron. Yeah, Granulus, I'm sure they knocked over something expensive. Yeah, Raymond, that's always fun to watch. Like, makes me want to play the Waffle House March. Oh, Keith, you and me both, man. Keith, you ready for the movie? You ready? I am, I am excited. I am so excited. I want you guys to know the day that those tickets are available, I will be gone. I will be, I will be purchasing those. I will be in line. I will be, I will be so hyped. I'm gonna buy all the seats around me. I'm gonna buy, actually my plan if I have the money for it, which I, I doubt I will. Um, I would like to buy the tickets for the seats in front of me so there will be no cell phones in my line of vision. So I'm going to have to start planning tactically with the, uh, with the seats they have available at the theater and uh, seeing what I can get. Because, like, listen... I need this to be perfect. I need no one around me talking about who they're dating, who they're, um, what's the wrong one? Being on their phones, playing phone games. Like, I, I need, I need that movie. Oh, the heck they will, Crumpet. I will kick them out. Like, excuse you, that's my seat. And then when they get out of it, I'll go back to my other seat. I'm like, well, hold on now. You said that was your seat. It's like, yeah, I bought 10 of them. <laughs> uh, Phaedrus, you can, but I don't think you can rent it for like opening night. That's the, uh, that would be the big issue. Did I not? No, I bought cargo because I'm I'm poor. Oh no, movies! That's how I get in trouble, and then I don't get to finish watching it. I just ooh, I have an idea. Yeah. <laughs> That's it, Crumpet. I'll bring a hockey puck. As soon as I see someone acting up, bam. There we go. <laughs> you know, AJ, I, I, uh, I wouldn't put it past you. All right, there we go. There we go. Huh. Well, movies, I'm just saying, if baby or adult, if they start acting up, I'll, uh... <coughs> oh. 
Oh, sorry. I'm gonna enjoy my movie. Alright, AJ, here's 50k for the ride along. <coughs> ah. Sorry. I need to go get water. So I think we're gonna wrap it up here for the day. Uh, Keith, it is Transformers Rise of the Beasts. It is a sequel to Bumblebee. No Michael Bay. No continuation of Bay. It takes place in the 90s. Oh, AJ, I'm sorry. But yeah, yeah, uh, Keith, look up Transformers Rise of the Beasts. There is a trailer for it. You have Mirage, Stratosphere, uh, Optimus Prime, RC, Wheeljack. I mean, movies are still going to be explosions. But uh, there's also going to be the Terracons, Maximals, possibly the Predacons. All big cast, so. Anyway. I want you guys to have a wonderful night. If I can get everything cleared tomorrow and uh, set up and whatnot, no promises, but uh, I might actually try a cam stream tomorrow. You guys can get a look at my ugly mug and all my transformers. So you guys have a wonderful night. Enjoy yourselves. Get excited for the new transformers movie. I'm sorry, but I'm going to uh, advertise that for free. And Rain, you should go see if you still have those. Beast Wars was amazing. That's right, AJ. That's right. That's right. So, you guys have a good one. Enjoy yourselves. Drink plenty of water. I'm going to go chase down some food. And, uh... Yeah, and for that, we'll, uh, we'll wrap it up there and uh, reconvene tomorrow. So drink some water. Be nice to yourself. That's right, Crumpet. I will. I will. <laughs> All right. Guys, have a good night. And as always, keep on trucking. Have a good one, all.